For today's Tip Tuesday, we'll be taking this cactus plant and turning it into a balm DIY detangler that can help soften your hair strands and melt those tangles away. So let's get into it. Hello my YouTube family, it's Michelle, better known as Now I Am Nappy, and today we'll be taking cactus or Nepal or tuna or prickly pear cactus and making this detangler. Now y'all, mom, I will say this, shout out to my mom, this one is for you. I grew up in El Paso, Texas, y'all. That is dry, dry desert, but you know what? We have a lot of prickly pear cactus. So let's go ahead and jump into this. Now y'all, it's not only found in El Paso, but of course the Caribbean and in certain parts of Africa. So let's jump into making this so we can detangle our matted hair. So I got three cactus pads from my local Mexican market and I noticed that it still had some of the spines left on it and I was worried about that getting into my skin when I would strain it. So I went ahead and used a sharp knife and just gently ran it across the cactus and the little spines all came up quite easily. Now I just want to note that or Organically Nicolette on Instagram was the first person to introduce me to using cactus and in this video she actually puts hers into a juicer. So if you have a juicer it doesn't look like you need to do any of this step and it also looks like you get quite a bit of mucilage from the juicing process. So if you're like me and you don't have a juicer go ahead and cut your cactus pad up into about one inch slices so you can easily add this to your blender. Now do the same with the remaining two pads so you'll have a total of three in this mixture. Next add about four ounces of distilled water and then blend like mad. After five minutes of blending use your nut milk bag and strain your mixture into it. It should be nicely fine and pulverized and you will receive a lot of mucilage when you squeeze the bag to get all of the goodness out. Now this mucilage will create a lot of slip for detangling our hair later on. Now y'all check out the remaining cactus in here. Imagine this would have been in your hair if we did not strain this out. And let's go ahead and move right along to putting this into a bottle for ease of use so we can pour this on our hair. So what I've been told and seen while using cactus, it should be really used from the scalp and all the way down the length of your hair to aid in detangling. Now y'all, I will say right away, my hair immediately started to feel that slip. It was easy to detangle my hair. I'm easily running my fingers through it. Like I'm kind of really shocked while doing this, but excited that this plant is working. So let me tell you a little bit about prickly pear cactus and why it works so well for our hair. So prickly pear is rich in vitamins A, C, and E as well as minerals like calcium, iron, magnesium, potassium, and a number of antioxidants. And they call it a superfood because it's rich in essential fatty acids, flavonoids, absorbic acid, carotenoids. And what that means for us in our hair is that because it's rich in omega-3 and omega-6 and vitamin E, it really helps to fight free radical damage and naturally stimulate collagen production in our hair and our scalp. Now this is important because it helps to keep our scalp and hair hydrated and promote a healthy pH. This plant is also said to aid in growing the hair strong and healthy at the hair follicle level as well as fighting hair fall. Now from what I've read online, this is more like a detangling cleanser or a co-wash. So I'm excited to share my results with you once I rinse this out. So after the product is in, y'all can see my curls are stretched, defined. Um, my hair is fully detangled. I'm gonna put a plastic bag on this and let this sit in for about one hour and then just rinse with warm water and come back on for you guys. 
And boom, just like that, I rinse out the product after one hour and my hair feels amazing. Now, while I lost the audio, I was basically saying that my hair feels clean, but not stripped. It's giving like co-wash energy. Now my scalp feels pretty clean, but my hair does not feel stripped in any way. I would say it's like a gentle co-wash. Highly, highly recommend it. And I can't stop touching my hair as per usual. I will be deep conditioning my hair after this to restore all the moisture. So make sure you are subscribed because you do not want to miss me mixing next week our cactus with some of our Ayurvedic herbs that produce a slip or a mucilage, y'all. This is going to be a bomb, bomb experience. We're going to play around with either making a gel out of this or either a detangler that just melts away all of our problems. Okay, you guys, side note, I forgot to mention, don't forget to vote on my community tab which challenge you would like to see us do next. The challenge will start September 1st. It's looking like the protective style slash length of retention challenge is gonna be the winner, but make sure you get your votes in. But that's it for this week. I'll see y'all next time. Bye.